Okay, guys, so, welcome back to another real life video. We're going to be messing with this engine. Um, we're going to tear it down. Um, it's off of a Craftsman Weevackle, but it's going to get tail down and we build. So, let's get to it. I do not bring any of my tools over here. Okay, I'll be right back. I did not grab an impact. Oh, well, I got a ratchet. We'll go we'll just go today. Okay, so um, I only took this head off off camera, and that's the main reason why we are doing it, like taking it off, because um, it needs to be uh, not redone. But um, I can't think of what I was trying to say. It needs to be. Um, Sealed back up because I took I would take these bolts out and they will loose like way loose. So um, I gotta go grab an impact and watch it. Be right back. Okay, let's get back to telling uh, this bolt down. So I'm gonna start up top and walk myself down. I feel like that's the uh, small thing to do. Size. That's gonna be the last thing you take off. And I don't really want to go get that size. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Okay, so let's take, try to at least send a vice so it shouldn't come off. Oh, okay. Maybe it's just going to spin then. Tap that probably. There we go. Oh, she cuts. Guys, I'm gonna tell you something right now. Even if it's a small engine like this, put your nuts back. Put all your nuts and bolts back. Because if you don't, you, you will look lose it. Trust me, I found out the whole way. Okay, so that stuff is off. Let's spin this around here. Oh, maybe I won't use spin. Okay. So here, let me. There we go. Now you can see better. That's hot. So let's hold up get I probably won't tail into the bottom end today because I wanna get see if I can make sure I can get parts before I do that. But um doesn't really matter because all this stuff that I'm getting ready to take off has been off before. So and we can always use pump guns too. That's not the right recipe. Maybe you do. Try it big. Okay. I shall be right back. Okay, we got the right size. Oh, sorry, I got the sport plug, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that in. On the back end, I should say. So, you might be asking, why does it have a comb oil? Uh, that looks like a new comb oil. Yes, it is a new comb oil. 
reason before, oh, well, the reason because, is we thought this used to be somebody my brother works, uh, did stuff for, and he brought to us, he said, hey, hey, what one? I, and we said, okay, we'll uh, diagnose it and uh, call you back with a solution. So, we uh, put a couple of it, that did work. In the process of me doing that, I broke the throttle thing because it was making me mad. So we got a new one of those. We tried to file it up, it wouldn't file up. So, they're like, hmm, that's strange. And we kind of just told the guy, hey, sorry, we can't get it fixed. Um, just go buy a new one. So, oh, that's going to have to be leaked out. Maybe not. So, that's what he did. And we got a new one. Um, so, we kind of just kept this one. Um, yeah, we just kept this one because he was going to use it. We was going to take scrap metal. And then yesterday, it's like, hey, I want to what was wrong, what's wrong with that. So, I pulled it out. There with the new gold wheel. That's good, all right. That, oh, no, that did not work. Okay, we're good. And, um, I went to just, uh, just the giggles, I pulled the head off, and I used that 3H ratchet, which isn't that powerful. So you have to, like, break it loose by hand, you know? But, um, I went to take it out, take them out, and they came out with these. Like, I didn't have to turn the ratchet or nothing, just squeeze the trigger. So, um, if you guys work on this kind of stuff, you're going to say, that's not right. Which, it's not, so. Um, okay, so, I'm going to go ahead and spin this around again. I do have to get a couple of numbers off this block tonight, so, on today. It's like 9 o'clock from now. Thank you. Now, I did put it, when I put it back on today, I did use an impact, so I'm probably going to have to. I can very easily go get another impact right now. I just don't want to. That one out. Let's see, got two, three more, three more. Let's put that in my way so I can do that. 
I will cut and this will be off. Last bolt. I want to see what this gasket looks like because I looked at yesterday. I didn't see no cracks. Which I. Eh, 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 eh. Lucky there, lucky there. So I don't know if that's. Right there, I don't know if that, uh, there it is. Right there, I don't know if that's from when me, when I, uh, when I put the thing back on, put it back on uh, this morning, or if that's from last night, or what, what it was wrong, I should say. I have no clue. So I'm gonna keep that on the show, um, a couple people, so. Now we're going to put all the bolts back in the block. And then... Hey! <coughs> oh. Sorry guys, I'm kind of sick. Well guys, that's going to do it for this video. Um, yeah, so... We got pretty much off, everything off, mask the bottom in. I'm gonna go find some parts for this. And then, uh, probably alter them. And then, uh, I'll do a part two. So, guys, if you like this content, down in the form sim or ATS, let me know and I'll try to do more. But, that's gonna do it for this one, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.